in a small New Jersey town, the unthinkable was about to happen. A shocking discovery was about to be made. A young boy narrowly escapes and tries to warn the town. But who would believe that lurking in the local creek was a shark? A shark in a creek miles from the ocean? I did not believe that this could possibly be true. But when I started doing research and I read the newspaper articles about this, I knew that it had to be a part of my series. I'm Lauren Tarshis. I'm the author of I Survived the Shark Attacks of 1916. That's right, this happened almost 100 years ago, but people are still talking about it today. Even the most famous scientists back in 1916 knew absolutely nothing about sharks. In fact, most people believe that sharks were absolutely tame, as tame as rabbits is how one scientist put it. So when these attacks first started to happen, nobody believed it. But it was true. In fact, this episode in history helped completely change scientists' attitudes about sharks. And you are going to find out because you are going to travel back with me to 1916. You're going to meet a boy named Chet who lived through this terrifying experience. Chet actually knows what it feels like to have a shark's jaws chomp on his leg. He lived through this extraordinary time with the people in his town. It was a summer they will never forget. Do you have what it takes to survive? Find out in I Survived the Shark Attacks of 1916. Also, be sure to check out Lauren Tarshis's I Survived Hurricane Katrina 2005. Look for these thrilling stories at your Scholastic Book Fair.